giant panda. Pandas are a species of bear and are three times the weight of other Asian bears, like the sun bear. But unlike any of their cousins, they are strict vegetarians. To show why their size is so important, I've come to Yarn Panda Sanctuary. And I hear my first panda before I see it. Oh, makes such an adorable sound. Here it comes, look. What an amazing creature. I can't believe that I'm stood just a stone's throw away from a giant panda. It's really quite extraordinary to think that there are only 2,000 of these animals left in the wild. They look like a big ball of fur and that comes down to those thick layers of fur and fat. They look so cute, but it's that same stocky round build that helps pandas to keep warm. Temperatures here can plummet to well below freezing. Until around two million years ago, pandas were smaller and ate meat, just like other bears. But a random change to their DNA meant they lost their umami taste receptors the receptors that allow carnivores to taste flesh. And it was around this time that they switched to a purely vegetarian diet, specializing in one type of plant. Giant pandas are very fussy eaters. 99% of the diet is made out of this stuff, bamboo. And never mind eating it, just trying to break it apart. Look at that, it is very difficult and requires huge amounts of energy. This new fibrous diet changed the way pandas looked. They developed huge, robust skulls for maximum bite strength. Size for size, the panda's bite is stronger than a polar bear's. It allows them to pulverize the bamboo. But the panda's specialized diet comes at a cost. In the 1980s, huge swathes of bamboo forest died out. Killing more than 10% of the entire species in a matter of years. It's a stark reminder of how vulnerable big animals can be. 